This segment will show you how to install the hanger brackets and shoulder bolts. Now please note, for better clearance, lower the tractor suspension arms using the attachment lift lever. Now on tractors with foot rest brackets, remove the bolt and nut that fasten the LH and RH foot rest brackets to the frame. Next attach the LH hanger bracket part 18, marked L, to the left hand inside of the tractor frame using two 3 8 inch by 1 inch carriage bolts, part L, and 3 8 inch flanged nuts, part II. Please note that the bolt heads go on the inside of the tractor frame. Now repeat these steps for the right hand side with the RH hanger bracket, part 19. On tractors without footrest brackets, find the empty hole beneath the footrest. Attach the LH hanger bracket, marked L, to the left hand inside of the frame using a 3 8 inch by 1 inch carriage bolt, part L, and a 3 8 inch flanged nut, part II. Please note that the bolt heads go on the inside of the tractor frame. Repeat these steps for the right hand side with the RH hanger bracket. Remove the bolt, washer, and nut which fasten the sway bar bracket to the left hand side of the tractor frame. Replace them with a shoulder bolt and a 3 8 inch flanged nut. Make sure that the bolt goes on the inside of the frame. Next, assemble a shoulder bolt and a 3 8 inch flanged nut to the right hand side of the tractor frame using the first empty hole to the rear of the RH hanger bracket. And again, please be sure that the bolt goes on the inside of the frame. 